understand volume. Today, we're going to learn about volume as an attribute of solid figures and how to measure volume of a rectangular prism using unit cubes. What measurable attributes do these figures have in common? They both have length and width. But wait, is there another measurable attribute? A three-dimensional figure, such as this rectangular prism, has height. A three-dimensional figure has space inside. This space is called volume. We can measure the volume of a three-dimensional figure. Which of these figures has volume? The cylinder, sphere, and cube have volume. What do you notice when you pack this rectangular prism with cylinders or spheres? These units do not fill the space completely. There are gaps between the solids. What happens when you pack the rectangular prism with unit cubes? The unit cubes fill the space completely. There are no gaps between them. The space occupied by a three-dimensional figure is called volume. To find volume, you can pack rectangular prisms using unit cubes with no gaps or overlaps.